Hello everybody and welcome to this London theatre vlog. I am so excited to be going back to the theatre once again. This time we're going to see Heathers. I literally have no luck getting rush tickets for Heathers ever. But today me and my mum, we went straight onto the app at 10 o'clock. My mum had the luck. We literally, as soon as it got to 10 o'clock and the tickets were released, I pressed the button and instantly tickets came up. So I'm honestly so excited to be seeing Heathers because it's one that I haven't seen yet live on stage. I have seen the 1988 film with Winona Ryder um, and it's a great film. It's so cheesy, it's so American um, and I love the songs of the musical. I've actually seen the live filming, live recording of the musical as well that was released quite recently and I love that. So I'm just really excited to actually be in the other palace and actually sitting there watching the show and yeah, it's just going to be amazing. Cannot wait. So it's about three o'clock now. We're going to go get the train to London, which will take about half an hour and then grab a bite to eat and then head straight to the theatre because we haven't really got much time before the show starts. It begins at 7.30 um, and I believe the show is about two hours 30, two hours 40. So it's going to be a really, really good evening and I'll show you what the view from my seat is like. Um, I'll show you curtain call and then I will give you my full review of what I thought of what the current production of Heathers is like. So I honestly cannot wait to go. So come and join me. Let's go. So I've gone for a very how American can I look look. Um, it's not very American at all to be fair apart from this jacket which I feel has a bit of an American look to it but I'm just wearing a green polo shirt which I got from Boohoo Man. This is from the Chem Collection in Primark um, which I really really like. I've actually got the green and the yellow t-shirt which also match with this but I'm not wearing it today just changing it up a little bit. Black jeans and then I've gone for my Nike Air Forces with my um, white Nike sock, Nike socks as well. So that is my outfit for the theatre. <laughs> singing today Hamilton but I'll be back before you know it. So we are just in Cardon Place which is located in Victoria I'm just gonna find somewhere to eat. I'm not too sure where to go, I don't know what I fancy. I see there's a Wagamama sign so I could do all of them Wagamamas right now but um yes we've got that. It's quite close to the other palace which is the theatre where Heathers is um so it'll be a nice quick meal and then we'll make our way over to Heathers. Yeah it's definitely gonna be Wagamamas we go to. Perfection. So this is the Wagamama's menu. Um, they've got quite a lot actually, so let's open it up. So yeah, they've got all these refreshing juices, which I've never had before, but would love to get. Loads of sides, which I think amazing. They've got ramen, they've got curry. This is what I normally go for, a katsu curry, but I'm actually probably gonna change it maybe to the firecracker chicken one. That looks really, really nice. Um, and then at the back, they've got cocktails and amazing soft drinks too. Right, I'm somebody who absolutely loves spicy food. I'm not like particularly used to it, but I do enjoy it when I have it. Wagon Mama's firecracker spicy curry. Wow. My mouth is literally burning. It's so hot, like the the fruit juice that I had really helped cool it down a little bit but wow it was so so hot and I feel like I've got all red my nose is red my nose was dripping it was yeah very very spicy it was nice it was a nice meal but yeah it just a bit too spicy for me probably won't get that one again so we just went into M&S Bakery to go and get an apple turnover for dessert looks like it's gonna be very tasty The other palace. Let's go in. So this is our view from row D and I can't get over how good it is. Like the 25 pound rush ticket, it's amazing.
it's midnight and I've just got home and I can officially say I have now seen Heathers. It was honestly everything I could have wished for and more. It was amazing. The cast were incredible. We had some understudies for Heather Duke and Heather Mack. So we did have understudies for them too. But actually all of the cast were phenomenal. They honestly blew me away. We were so close to the stage and I think in that theatre, no matter where you're sitting, you've got a good view. I didn't really like at the beginning, everybody kind of went into a bar. They didn't open up the auditorium for quite some time. So that was really, really frustrating. And we ended up, they only actually started letting us in at half past seven. And they said there was technical issues. That was partly why. Um, but we were just kind of waiting around in a bar for a long time and there were so many people crammed into that bar so that was really really frustrating in terms of the show it is such a it's such a feel-good show in a lot of ways the songs are so catchy the acting is so amazing the the singing is amazing obviously it does deal with some quite dark issues and dark themes it talks about suicide eating disorders um but there are warnings before you even enter the show about this um and if you've watched the classic film you'll know that that obviously is a big is a big theme but for me it's easily now gone into my top 10 so easily it's gone into my top 10 i loved it the program was 10 pound they had such amazing merchandise this was all i actually bought from there I hope it's a show that stays for a very, very long time. I loved every second and I really, really recommend that, particularly if you're a teenager, you're at, you know, high school yourself, um, or to be fair, anybody, that show, the audience was so varied. There was teenagers, there was younger children, there were families, there were old older couples. Like, honestly, this show is for everybody and I think everybody will love it and it will relate to everybody because we've all had that high school experience obviously I'm from the UK this is a very American themed show but actually the themes the show deals with everybody can relate to in some way so it is just phenomenal and I would definitely see it again definitely in my top 10 Highly recommend that you go to the West End or the tour because there is a tour also of Heather's going around. So check on the Heather's website. I'll link it down in the description below. But definitely, if Heather's is near you or coming near you, definitely go and see it because I highly, highly recommend. If you can't see Heather's for whatever reason, they also have a live recording of the stage show of Heather's. So again, if you want to get a, you want to see Heather's or you want to get Heather's fixed, which I know I'm definitely going to need to get a Heather's fix soon. I will go and watch that because, again, it's the show and it's just, it really, really is breathtaking. And the energy of that cast, incredible. Just amazing. Now, I'm not too sure when my next theatre trip will actually be. But, as you know, I absolutely love going to the theatre, so it probably won't be too long. So, yeah, you'll have to keep an eye on my YouTube page to see what theatre show is next. Thank you so, so much for watching this video. It was quite a short video. Um, I didn't really do as much as I would normally do on a London trip. Today was literally booking tickets at 10 and then just having an evening in London for the show. But overall, I had a really, really lovely day. Thank you so, so much for joining me. And I will see you very, very soon for my next vlog, whatever that shall be. Make sure you're hitting that subscribe button. It would mean the absolute world to me. And I will see you real soon. Bye, guys. Thank you.